Well, new developments today is former UW Oshkosh baseball coach Tom Lechner now claims his dismissal from the school has nothing to do with his coaching. Instead, he claims it was about fundraising. Lechner spoke alongside his attorney, former Packers general counsel Jason Weed today, Lechner wearing a UW Oshkosh polo shirt. The coach says he was told in May his contract would not be renewed. The coach says UW Oshkosh blamed him for debt associated with building a new baseball stadium. Lechner says he raised enough money for the stadium to be built. Lechner says he filed for one final appear, appeal rather, for a public hearing last Friday and is waiting to find out if he's going to get to make his case. If that hearing does not work, Lechner and his attorneys say they are considering their options, including a possible lawsuit. Lechner says all he wants to do is coach Oshkosh baseball again. He spoke today about meeting with one of the school's vice chancellors who told the coach he'd be a scapegoat for the debt. And he told me, Tom, we blanked this whole thing up. It's not your responsibility. It's our responsibility. You're going to get the blame. I lost the argument with the other vice chancellor to the chancellor regarding this. Um, and she's been given the green light to get rid of you. They attributed a debt to Tom that was not his responsibility. He asked too many questions, and that ended up costing him his job. That's really our position. You can see what's on my chest today. I believe in our program. I went to school there. I played there. My goal is to coach baseball at Oshkosh. Now, the university issued a statement today saying they're not going to comment on Lechner's contract not being renewed, saying that's a personnel matter. The school says it is taking a new direction with the baseball team. School officials also released details of fundraising efforts for their new baseball stadium. They claim fundraising was about $280,000 short. They would not say, however, if that was a factor in Lechner's dismissal. I spoke with a university spokesman on the phone who confirmed Lechner is going through the school's appeals process. As Coach Lechner, I think, acknowledged today and as we acknowledge in our statement that he has a, he has a right to appeal and he's exercising that through our campus process. So we're, we're deciding not to comment on the personnel matters as that process continues along.